Ethan's mask. How do you hear about it in the first place? He said a voice spoke to him one night, entreated him to collect the mask and control his own fate. I still think it's all a bunch of bollocks. Odin got drunk, convinced himself a wooden mask would solve all his problems, and pranced about the realms until he found a sufficiently mysterious bauble to fit the bill. Mask probably doesn't do anything at all. Yeah, probably. I can sharpen that axe if you want. Living Whetstone, that's me. Thanks for grabbing that for us. About time I had something to do. Now that is an axe. Take care now. Wait, are those Odin's ravens? The ones we've been destroying all this time? So it would seem. New father, new mother, new fate to suffer. I wanted to tell you. I read something in Odin's library about what Gjallarhorn is supposed to do. If blown by a god, it sounds through all the realms and harmonizes the space between them. Blow it somewhere like Tyr's temple, and it would be like opening up all the realm travel towers at once. It's quite a vulnerability. Wonder why he didn't just destroy it. Some artifacts defy destruction. Well, we should make Freya aware of this. Try with that axe if you tried. Done. How lucky I have need of your help. As you ask. What a rambunctious bunch. Speak. The tree has become rather overgrown. And. And, if it grows too wildly, the branches risk getting too heavy and falling, which is not ideal, considering they hold all the rounds. I am no gardener. What an absolute shock. No, I do not require any horticultural skills from you, but I would ask that you keep an eye open for the stags of the Four Seasons. They normally graze upon the tree and keep it tidy. Unfortunately, Bitter decided it would be funny to trick Arrogant into releasing them. If you happen to find the stags during your travels, I would greatly appreciate assistance in bringing them home. I would have one of my spectral squirrels do it, but they, well, keep eating the feed I give them. Consequence of it being the most delicious food in all the Nine Realms, I suppose. We have seen these stags. Great! Then all you need is some feed. Once you've found a stag, the feed should calm them down. Then one of my spectrals will guide them back here. And, uh, don't eat the feed, please. I will not. Vigilance asked me if I was too chicken to release them, but I am in fact not chicken like whatsoever. So, as you can see, I had no choice. Yes, of course. What else could you have done? <sighs> While normally this would be a harmless prank, Fimblewinter prevented the stags from returning. 
And now they have long since scattered to parts unknown. It was worth it. Now then, any luck finding those lean worms? Seems we met another of your detachable emotional apparitions. Bit too twitchy to tell us his name, though. Ah, you must mean anxiety. Oh, no. Why are you talking about me? What did I do? Oh, you should have heard the shit they were talking. Sad. What? Oh, dear, oh, dear. There was no such talk. Shame on you, Bitter. Are you sure? Yes, Anxious. No opprobrium to be found in this discourse. I was merely making your acquaintance with our adventuring friends here. Ah, people! Well, there it is. I suppose I needn't take up more of your time. Spear would do the trick. Well, happy Ragnarok, everybody! Let's drink. Is it true? Heimdall's dead. I can't believe it. There's no stopping it now. Odin swore peace only so long as you spilled no more Aesir blood. I refuse that deal. Yet he honored it. But now. But what? You and I know better than anyone that Odin's promises never last. We have the advantage now. It's time to bring him down. No. None of you understand what's coming. Odin's vengeance will be his only concern. Not his only concern. The mask. Whatever knowledge it unlocks, that's what Odin wants more than anything. If I go back to Asgard, go I can... Back. Go back. Look, if I can finish what I started there, awaken the mask, get answers, maybe that's our way out of this. But I gotta go soon, before they figure out what's happened. Joyce, you are home. Do not ask me to put you at risk again. He's at risk where he stands, Kratos. We all are. Anything we do or don't do is dangerous right now. But Odin needs me. He trusts me. I'll be safe there. From a tactical perspective, am I wrong? I don't much like it. But it is our best play. Dividing Odin's focus would buy us time. And give us a pair of eyes in the enemy's inner sanctum. But if there is truly a source of infinite knowledge, you can't let Odin have it. Aye. And once he has what he needs from you, then I lose my leverage. I get it. I'll be smart. Father. I can do this. Remember our promise. You too. I do too, Sam. Well, I still want to hear how you did it. You mean how we did it? Ah, uh, you yeah, have it. And therein lies a tale.
Trace, listen. I can't let you go back without this. A hammer? Your key, please. You ever need a way out of a bad situation? Throw this down hard and say Wergi. One use only. Wergi. Thanks, Indri. Hope I don't need it. Me too. All right. Odin said Hugin would be waiting in the cabin. Mimir, anything else I should know about Odin? Maybe a weakness or something? Like if I flip up his eye patch, he'll disintegrate. I lad, wouldn't that be? Yeah, no. Sorry, Mimir. I can't do your accent. I'm on my own for this one. We go. Oh, were you having a moment? It sort of looked like you were having a moment. I can go. No. Sorry. This is Fenrir. It's okay, Ben. She's, uh... <laughs> so, I was right about your knife. Huh? I'm glad you found a place for his soul. <laughs> me too. Hey, uh, how'd you find me here? Loki? This is my marble. Then where are you heading off to? Back to Asgard. Hey, I'm actually using him. Uh-huh. Angerboda, look. Once I see this through, I'm gonna know everything. How to save my father, how to stop Ragnarok. And maybe, hopefully, how to bring our people back. Loki, those are all very noble intentions. But he's Odin. You have faith in me, right? Of course I do. I just hope the story you're writing for yourself is the one that you truly want. Would you... Would you take care of Finn while I'm away? I'll take good care of him. Good night, boy. <laughs> Be careful, Loki. Okay. 